Stephanie the hippo indeed. Um, thank you, James. I don't quite know what these hippos are doing. It looks like we may have some mating going on of some hippo, which is a very rare occurrence to actually see. In particular, yes, we definitely have some mating going on. <laughs> which is quite a rare occurrence to actually see on, uh, on Safari Live. And there we go. The, this is... Uh, frozen a little bit thankfully but you can see that this male hippo is mating with a female in the water which is something that we quite often talk about at safari live but we don't often see this is the first time that i think i've been able to show anybody mating on the program or that i've actually heard about and you can see that it happens in the water birth birthing of the hippo calf happens um, on land but the actual mating happens in the water and you can see that the poor female hasn't had a breath in quite some time now uh, it doesn't see there we go there the nose comes up with this female this would be the bull hippo in this particular pod that is the biggest and uh, obviously the strongest and most suitable for a partner for her and of course to father her youngsters and you can see that they've made their way a little bit further away from the rest of the pod there is a youngster probably oh there we go there's another couple looking on um, with some interest hippo of course very social creatures and what happens is as soon as there's some activity around they're all quite inquisitive and will come and see what's happening now what i don't know and what i can't tell you is how long this is going to go on for i have never seen this before with my naked eye and um and I don't know whether it's going to last long, like a rhinoceros, for instance, which can go on for 40 minutes or so, or whether it's going to be short, which, uh, like a lion, a couple of seconds, two or three seconds. Now, Francis, all the way from Israel, you've just asked me, is it possible that she could drown? Francis, just judging from the sheer number of hippo in this river, I doubt that this is something that is uncommon, and that... You know, mating in the water with bull hippo that can weigh up to, you know, three, sometimes even four tons. Uh, mating in the water would make it a lot easier than mating on land. Now, how long can hippo hold their breath for is also part of this question. Now, Francis, hippo can hold their breath for, bull hippo can hold his breath for about eight minutes, seven or eight minutes uh, at a long stretch. And a newborn calf can hold their breath for about 30 to 40 seconds. So I don't know if we can count the breaths that this female's taking, but there's one there. And we can start our stopwatch there, but I would assume that she's not holding her breath for longer than 30 seconds or so, 30 seconds to a minute. So this, you know, tolerating this bull hippo doing his thing is probably well within her ability to hold her breath. Now it looks like he's slid off there. there there's the female going forward, yes. And the male has gone underwater to I don't know, hide away. <laughs> but, so that answers your question. So mating doesn't take very long. Looks like it takes between sort of three and five minutes. And the hippo, once done, moves off. Now, CNAT, you wanted to know if this hippo, once she's had her baby, once she's had her baby, which will be if she falls pregnant at this coupling, uh, which will be in about eight months time how many babies is she going to have and see max she's going to have one baby it's usual only for hippo to have one baby at a time um, there's not it's not uncommon for any mammal to have twins but for these large mammals with ultra long gestation periods that need to give birth to babies that are are able to look after themselves in the case of a hippo able to swim from birth um, it would make sense that uh, that she only gives birth to one baby. And uh, she'll give birth to this little calf, if this coupling is successful, uh, in about eight to nine months' time. Interestingly, for an animal that weighs exactly the same as a white rhinoceros, uh, it is half the gestation time. And isn't that an amazing fact? Half the gestation time. And from what I understand about it, simply because um, hippos have a good diet and they live fairly unstressed lives half of which is in water now what we're going to be doing is sending you all the way south down to south african byron who is on a birding adventure 